Hey guys, Valeros here. Today I will be showing you how to make a mobile Quetzal trap. Alright, so for this you will need a Quetzal, a Quetzal platform saddle, and the stuff on my bar right here. Six foundations, uh, one gate, or gateway rather, uh, 18 ceilings and 14 walls. Uh, they do not have to be stone since a Quetzal will not attack while you are shooting at it. it they can't damage the structure so if you wanted to you could use, honestly you could use thatch. Other than that, uh, having a grapple hook and a crossbow for when you have the Quetzal in your trap so it doesn't knock you out would probably be a good idea. I forgot to spawn that stuff in when I was in creative mode, so I can do that here in a minute. But let's get on with making this uh, trap. So we're going to start with our six foundations. When you place these down, you want them to be in about the middle part of that saddle handle right there and hanging over a little bit. This way we can lay six of these down on this platform, just like so. Now, off of these six foundations, we're going to place ceilings in a u-shape around this just to give us a little more room on here like so after you've placed those what is that uh, six ten after we place those ten ceilings right there we're going to grab our walls you don't have to use doorways if you don't want to I recommend using doorways just in case you, uh, you have a buddy helping you out and you can shoot from the sides and stuff or if you happen to get knocked out but I'm just going to have them doorways cause I, and it makes it easier to see the Quetzal when you're trying to fly around and trap it but we're going to place two doorways on the left side or right side and two doorways on the left two doorways in the middle overhanging like that on ascended you are able to do that which is super nice two doorways right there, one back and one further back from that, so one further back, two doorways, one further back, two more doorways and we're going to do the same thing on the left side. Uh oh, I think that one placed down there. Let me pick this up. Place, place, and place. Now we're going to take our remaining eight ceilings and we're going to place them one back from the front, crapper doodles. Be careful doing this if you're on official because they uh, they changed official where you can no longer pick up structures after a certain amount of time. So just be careful with that. Place those ceilings down. Then with the back set of walls, we're going to place more ceilings down. Now what we're going to do is line the Quetzal that we're wanting to tame up with this hole in the back of the trap. We're going to let it fly in. As soon as that Quetzal flies in, we're going to hop off and come back here and place our dino gate right there. That way the Quetzal can't get out. And then we're going to shoot it and knock it out. So let's go ahead and pick up our gateway. Hop on our Quetzal. I think there was a Quetzal over here. If we can find the sucker. We might have to land this guy though because it looks like he's getting low on stamina. Uh, I will come back after I find this Quetzal. Alright guys, I am back. I had to spawn a Quetzal in because I couldn't find the, other, find the other one that I had. So, if you're having problems because you have a low level Quetzal and you can't get enough stamina on it to follow one of these around or to bring the Quetzal from your base, your tame Quetzal from your base out. Uh, have it follow an RG with decent stamina, then just land your RG. Oh, no, no, no. You want to change its follow distance too. We're just going to land our RG here. Whistle him to stop follow. Hey, there's the one I was going to tame. Hop off of here pop down into here and I did grab some grapples but I'm in creative mode right now so it doesn't matter and then what we'll do is we will just fly up here to our Quetzal 
We're gonna go ahead and use this one right here. Since he decided to come back within render range. And we're just gonna turn our trap and maneuver it so we're trying to try to have that opening in front of him and just hold the X key once you think you're in position. So he's flown in. Put the gate down. Make sure you have one wall length on either side of the gate. If you have two, he'll be able to fly out, he or she. And then you can just start knocking them out. Easy peasy. Let him squeeze. Just like that. Now be careful when you do this because when you knock these guys out on a mobile trap like this, sometimes they can ragdoll out of the trap, as you see right there. So just keep that in mind. Uh, you Make sure you don't knock it out over water. But that is how to make and trap a Quetzal in Ark Survival Ascended. I hope you guys found the video useful. If you did, please like, and if you're not subscribed to the channel, Please subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.